So we're back. My uh, game kind of froze. I had to quit the recording so I could leave the uh, loading screen. That's not matter. I still have a great part in that. So we're just gonna continue on what I was talking about. So the booklow mod from last part I was talking about, and then I got cut off, unfortunately. So uh, it is a red glowed for uh, skill books. Light blue glowed for normal books, and then uh, another sort of glow for uh, quest books, I presume. It took me weeks to find that thief's dead. I can't stop now, and I can't get the sword on my own. So you're willing to starve your wife and daughter to reclaim some rusty old sword? I just need to hire one, maybe two good men. Star. I'll put it plainly. You can claim your sword or you can keep your wife. If you set foot outside that gate, I won't be here when you return. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. You're not from Skyrim, are you? No, I'm not. Looks like we've got something in common then. No, I'm a Red Guard. My family hails from the Imperial Province. Ah, but I left home when I was just a lad. Been wandering ever since. What were you two arguing about? Not that it's really any of my business, but I'm gonna ask anyway. My sapphire doesn't like that I've been spending so much time looking for my father's old sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. Do you need help finding the sword? I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby. But I'm no fool. I'd need the white run guards or maybe hire the companions to get it. I don't know why I'm saying this, but if you find it out in your travels, I'd be grateful to you. I'll find you your sword, um, Ren. Sapphire, give me your money. Wait, I... I... I don't have any money. You better give me five septums right now or I'm gonna blow... Five? Are you fucking serious? Ten septums tomorrow, baby Battleborn. Or I'm gonna bloody your nose and your lip. No, please! I really don't have any money, Brace. I'll give you two septums tomorrow. Just don't hit me. It's no fun getting... Well, I used to sneak out at night and try to tip over the big ox in the Grey Mane's yard. And me and Mila used to climb up on the roof of Dragon's Reach and look for bird's eggs. But I don't do that stuff anymore. Father keeps catching me, and then I get in trouble. Right. <laughs> You just got your ass big kicked by your little girl, dude. You're pathetic. Yes, of course. We leave immediately. It's just us against the dragon. Is that it? I can't afford to send anyone else, and we don't know where the dragon is. Your main job will be to keep an eye out and get the people to safety if the town is attacked. I don't expect the three of you to fight off a dragon by yourselves, but I do expect you to do your duty. Of course. We'll keep everyone safe. You can count on it. Let's move out. Time's a wasting. <laughs> He's going alone. <laughs> Hey man, you going to Riverwood? Guess I'm gonna follow you cause I have to go that way anyway. Yeah. You're going on your own. With everything in your way. Oh look, you have a nice little uh, torch there. That looks pretty cool. Did I ever tell you about the time I used to walk around the world and Discover a few things. Why are you going so fast? God damn it! You almost walked in that wood. You're weird. <laughs> Follow the guard. He knows where he's going, right? I don't. I'm not so sure what I'm doing right now. I'm just <laughs> following. I want to see if he reaches the destination he needs to go. Where's he going? 
What was the point of that? You weird. Where are you going now? <laughs> okay. He's got to wear a thing sometime. Oh look, it's another torch. I also have colorful torches in this mod pack, in this series. So I have like purple ones and white ones, and red ones and green ones. I think that's it. I'm not so sure. But yeah, colorful torches. Pretty cool. And they last twice as long as normal torches. Which is also pretty cool. Yeah. We'll get there one day. I'm just gonna hold morsel. Okay. What? Okay. Hey man, you're leaving me. Come back here. I was just checking out some dead bodies, and you're fucking on your way to Rascal City. Hello. Need something? Okay. All right, then. <laughs> Random people running around. Well, brother, this is where we sideways. You go to the left, and I'll go to the right. 